Hello children from Bednam and Holbrook. Welcome to another how-to video and today we're going to look at the Oak Academy. Now you will have all your lessons given to you through Google Classroom and there will be a variety of lessons. Some will be documents that we create for you, some will be links to videos, some will be links to elsewhere on the internet. One of the major sources of lessons that we have for you are from the Oak National Academy and I want to just show you how they work, the lessons that they provide. They're an excellent resource so we are really privileged to be able to access them. I'm just going to search for the Oak National Academy. You will have the links given to you directly so don't worry too much about that. Um, and I will go in as if I'm a pupil into classroom, subjects, and I'm going to imagine I'm a year three pupil today, but you'll be given the link that goes directly to the lesson that you need. Now, the great thing about Oak National Academy is that all their lessons are freely available online and the only resources that you need, you don't need to print anything off at all. The only resources that you need will be a pencil and paper. That's the bare minimum. And the reason is because if you're doing something like maths, you will need to write some jottings down and use a written method in order to calculate your answer to a maths problem. So you, you can't do all of that online. You can do certain multiple, multiple choice quizzes, but you won't be able to write down your... Um, your answers and your working out without access to pencil and paper. So really here, what, what you will need is a, a pencil and paper. And if you don't have access uh, to that, have a word to the school. I'm going to look at English first. And I'm going to go down to a setting description lesson, lesson one in a setting description unit. So each unit seems to be about a week, um, five lessons, or the, there may be two week units. Um, I haven't seen them all. Um, each week will, uh, and each lesson will look broadly the same. So you will start the lesson with an introductory quiz. If this is a second lesson, this will be a quiz just on stuff that you picked up in the first lesson from the lesson before. So this introductory quiz is an online multiple choice. So you just answer those questions, submit what your your answers are, and then it will be marked for you. And you can find out where you went wrong and try and understand and improve your understanding of the questions. Then after you've done that introductory quiz, you close it, you go onto the next, you press next to go on to the next part of the, the lesson. Now, this will always be a video. And the fantastic thing about the Oak National Academy is that, that they have a video to accompany every single lesson. And those videos are by teachers. So you will get a proper teacher input for each lesson that you have. And you will need to work alongside with um, your teacher uh, who, who may vary depending on what the lesson is. So in this case, you um you have this chap here telling you what you need to to know for that lesson and at some point he will say he he might say right we're going to do an activity together so you will write on your paper and work alongside with the teacher or they might say you need to pause the video and go on to the next activity which is an independent activity so you close the video down. The great thing here is that it doesn't disappear. It is still there at exactly the point you left it. So if I press resume, I was it would go back to the teacher at exactly the point that you left it. So I'm going to close that again. I'm going to go on to the next activity. So remember, you've had an introductory quiz, an input from the teacher, possibly done some work with the teacher. And now the teacher will say it's time for an independent activity close the video and press next and it will give you the uh, instructions there. So here we have the worksheets. Now, as I've said, you do not need to print these off. As long as you have access to pencil and paper, you can answer these questions. In this case, it says, right, make sure you've watched the video. Here's some reading to do. It's another little bit of reading. And now we're going to answer some questions. It tells you how to answer the questions and you will only need to write number one, 
You don't need to write the question, just write your answer. You will see each question has different amount of marks or the same marks, but it will tell you how how much you need to write for your answer. So if it's a three mark question, you need to be thinking about three different things. On to the second uh, part, we have uh, some more questions that again, you only need to write the answers to on your sheet. And after that independent activity, there are, there are spellings that you will need to work on because throughout the week you'll you'll work on the same spellings and then have a little test at the end of the week through the Oak National Academy. And then that's the end of the uh, the slide slideshow. So you once you have done that, you would then return to the video and finish the lesson. So the teacher will go through the work you've done with you so that you fully understand where you've gone wrong and what the right answer is and and why it's being asked and how it's being asked. And teacher will take you through it as, as would happen in a normal lesson. And the last thing you have is a final quiz that wraps up the learning from that, that, that particular lesson. So you will do another multiple choice um, quiz and then submit those answers and see how you did. And then the next day, you will get an introductory quiz, which talks about the stuff that you learned today. So tomorrow, you get an introductory quiz, another video that you watch the input, maybe do some, some work with the teacher. And then you close the video, do the independent task. Then you open the video again to check your independent task. And then you do the closing or final quiz. And that's that. That's fantastic. I, I'm going to come out of this, and I'm now going to look at um, the maths for you just to show you that it's pretty much the same thing I, I'm going to come down for no particular reason so you can see this unit is actually angles and shape is a three-week unit so there's 15 lessons there um, so it just does does depend this is just a two two day sort of little session on multiplication division so let's look at the first lesson. Start the lesson. So I'm guessing there's going to be an introductory quiz. There we go. So you would do the quiz and then next there's a video. And again, it's the same sort of thing. You would watch the video. You're going to get a teacher Look talking uh, and talking you, taking you through the learning for the day. You would then close that video and remember it's up here. So you can access it on the next so if you forget something from the input, you can always go back and look at it. Um, but you have the slides here for the main activity. And remember, you do not need to write out the questions. You just need to write number one and your answer on your sheet of paper. And then once you've worked through these questions, and there will be some maybe some word problems like these, you don't need to write out the question. You just write the answer and you're working out. Once you've gone through all of them, mm. You will then continue with your video until the end of the lesson. And once you've marked your work with the teacher, you go on to the final part of the lesson, which is the quiz, the final quiz. And once you've done that, that is the lesson over. That is the Oak Academy for you. There are absolutely tons of resources in the Oak Academy, and it's a fantastic resource. So please use it um, when you are directed to through Google Classroom. And that is what you will need to do. Any questions, you can always put comments on the Google Classroom website, on the stream or the classwork, or you can uh, message your teachers directly. So um, as ever, do your best and uh, good luck.